is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, the 14th of September, almost halfway through the month. Brutal cascade yesterday. Over 1,200 points. At one point, it was over 1,300 points. Today, we're up 93. Uh, you can see the Chapman Wave inside track, what should be the propellant zone. We'll see at this point, it's still a repellent zone. If, perchance, over the next uh, few sessions, we can actually start to trade in the 31,550 area, that'll say, okay, it was a one-off thing. We could expect more of these, but uh, we're going to be watching this very closely. Looking at the S&P, the S&P at this particular point is up 16 at 39.48. Now, it did not take out the low of uh, early September. It was a very sharp move to the downside. We're up 16 at 39.49. So far, that's kind of okay action. And if you look at the QQQ, also did not take out the left side low. It's trading at 295.20, uh, up $1.50. Uh, not bad action after yesterday. <clears throat> At least there isn't follow through to the downside yet. And the one, and the IWM, the Russell 2000, is down just a little bit, down 12 cents. At 182.17, also didn't take out the left side low. To me, that's that's an important thing. Looking at gold, <clears throat> gold is down 4 at 17.13. The dollar... And this is going to be important. Uh, if you're looking at the dollar, the dollar's pulling back here. Had a very sharp move to the upside yesterday. Uh, and that, that was part of the whole scenario where you got the dollar rallying. Um, you know, that just put, put a lot of weakness into the market. And we're pulling back a little bit here. We'll see whether the dollar is able to hold the 107 support. Uh, or break above 110.50 to say oh, it wants to retest the previous high. Crude oil, uh, crude oil at this particular point is up. It's up two at 89.48. I think that crude oil is trying to treat that left side low that it took out um, as some kind of a support level that it wants to go high. It's above the 200 period moving average. And the TLT, the TLT is down 40 cents at 107.27. So yields are still pretty high. I'll be back for the Tiger Technician's Hour. I hope you can stay. Be right back. Great programming here at TFNN. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Technician's Hour.